Yay, today is your lucky day. You are going to plan Thanksgiving dinner. Today I'm going to go over your tasks with you. First, let's do some brainstorming. Think about Thanksgiving dinners you have eaten before. What foods do you normally eat? What are some yummy desserts that sound good for Thanksgiving? Make a circle map or web of everything you can think of related to shopping for Thanksgiving dinner. You're just going to click in the circle and you can type in here. If you need to add more boxes, you can insert a text box. I'll show you how to do that at the end. Now you have room for 10 people at Thanksgiving, including yourself. Think about nine people you want to invite to dinner and make your guest list. Your guest list might be a little smaller than 10 people. Think about the people you will be having Thanksgiving with this year. Now here are some no common dinner um, ideas and sides. Okay, and it has a price on it. This will be helpful when you make your shopping list. Here's some drinks and desserts. So now in your plan for Thanksgiving dinner, you will have a budget. Okay, so we're ready to plan your own Thanksgiving dinner. You've been told that if you can stick to this budget, you can be in charge of planning the menu. You've been given a budget of $80 to, to follow. This means you only have $80 to spend and you cannot spend more than this. Okay. On your assignment, there will be circles for you to circle each of your choices. You need to choose a main course. Okay, so you'll drag a circle around it and then you will choose at least three sides for your dinner and you'll start drag your circle over your choice. Okay. Then you have to choose at least one special drink to serve. You can choose more than one, but remember you have a budget. Then you are going to choose at least two desserts to serve. Okay. When it says at least, that means you have to do two, but you can do more. Now you're going to list all the items that you decided to purchase for your dinner below. And you'll write the price next to it. So you'll need to type in what you choose from those two pages on this slide right here in the item. Okay, to get the price, you'll have to go back a few slides to the prices, to the dinner and sides, and the drinks and dessert. And you'll record the price here. Then you'll have to add it all up and type it here. How much money did you have in your budget? Well, you had $80, so you're going to type that there. How much money did you spend in all? That's how much your total was. Okay. Did you have any money left over in your budget? How much money you had left over? Okay. If so, how much? Right here. How did you find out how much money you had left over in your budget? You're going to put your answer right in this area. Even if, if you want to type your equation or the problem you use, or you can use words to explain what you did. Why did you choose the items you did? Do you think you did a good job for shopping for Thanksgiving dinner? Why or why not? The last question at the very bottom is, what is your favorite Thanksgiving food? And you're going to type your answer there. Okay. Let's go back to the top here. I want to show you really quick how to add a text box. So here's a big text box. Okay everywhere it says type here, but if you have other ideas and there, you have more ideas on what's there, this is how you will add a text box. Okay, do you see this little T up here? Even whenever I hover over it, it says text box. I'm going to click on it and then I can add a text box just like that. And you can add as many as you would like. Okay, this is the only page that you'll be adding a text box. Everything else has them um, there for you. Enjoy planning your Thanksgiving dinner. Have fun.